What's going on everybody? So we are officially on day two. Both the previous videos that I've done on the channel have been on day one, but we're moving on to day two here and I have a ton more summons to go through. Um, I was kind of just running through the game. I was just enjoying the game. Um, I'm sure I messed up something on my early game progression. I'm not sure what the banner um, is looking like. There's a lot of things that I can see already you know, I'm saving for and things that I want to make videos on because I think they're pretty important. But I also found out later on that uh, you can actually acquire, I believe it's from this event. Yeah, so 84,000 points, we get a copy of Ravenna, um, which I think is a really cool character. And I want her just because I think it's cool. Um, you get a copy of her. So I don't feel like I need to summon for her at all. And I'm probably just going to save my summons. Maybe we'll see. Um, I'm going to wait till the end of the week, you know, Four or five days from now and see if i want to go ahead and jump in for luke here uh because well getting another copy of oisa is always solid I'm, I'm happy to get another copy of that we have a lot more summons in the basic advanced category here so we're going to pop those and just give you an update on where i'm at with my account so let's get into it all right so as for heroes at the moment i currently have i don't know what you call this i don't know how this system works yet uh, it looks like you're going to expand this even further, but I do have a couple of evolutions for some of these characters down here. <clears throat> I'm not sure how they changed color or what, but you can see I could dump another copy of this guy in here. So it looks like I could expand them and it looks like it goes up to five little marks here and it increases the stats all the way through. So that's what I'm looking for. Um, the exclusives that actually has nothing to do with, you know, duplicates, but regardless, I have one dupe. I've put into Omar, uh, one dupe I've put into Rakana, uh, one dupe into Oisa, and then I have <clears throat> one dupe coming to me for Sorietta here. Other than that, I have no triple S heroes. Um, I am using the healer that you get for free from the tower mode, whatever it's called. And so that's what I've been using pretty much. These two are actually really solid, really solid AoE DPS, really solid assassin type character, good tank, uh, decent kind of damage amping tank in artists. And then uh, we have the healer, which has been serviceable so far. So I'm not really sure what I'm looking for. Obviously any triple S would be good. I think I'm looking for more of a hardcore DPS carry. I think that Oisa is fine as a tank alone. And I'd like to replace artists is what I'm thinking. I do think that I need a good healer. And I, if I get a better healer than uh, Liren here, I'm completely fine with that. But honestly, she's completely fine or they're completely fine at the moment so definitely definitely not too worried about that regardless we're going to see what we can get we are really close to pitying here so you can see we're 24 out of 30 and i believe this is going to give us a rare or an elite character so we're gonna have to find out what we get and we're also three summons away from pitying on the advanced one which will guarantee us an elite I'd love Taylor. Um, I'd love a couple of these characters in here. You know, the wish list here. I probably should put Taylor on it just because I think he's so, so good if he's able to be picked. Looks like he's not, but that's fine. Um, out of all these, if I, I think the most wanted character out of all of these is going to be Serena. She is an amazing healer. Uh, she's going to heal so, so much healing. Um, and of course, defense increase, which is also very, very powerful for your tanks as well. Just an overall solid, solid character uh, for healing. And I'd love to have her in replace of my current healer. So that's the only one I'd really change. But regardless, let's just jump in, do our 10 pull here, see what we end up getting. Not skipping it. I think the summon animation is pretty cool. And, you know, I'm summoning. I'm free to play. I don't get to see the summons that often, so I want to see them. Um, I Again, I think the purple means that I'm getting a purple character, an elite. So we'll have to see. I'm sure by the time this video comes out, I've already posted the other video, um, which means some of you probably have left a comment. We got League here, or Liege. I'm not convinced about this guy, so, eh. <laughs> not super excited about him but regardless we got another elite i guess that's cool um to have so yeah so in the same rose attack gains defense a little bit of damage yeah so not a huge fan of this guy let's go next temple i gotta pay attention to this color on the front of the capsule here see if it's gonna be a purple come on i guess we got another purple so we'll have to see if we get another elite because if we get another elite then oh we got another karma so I, I i like this guy i don't think he's as good as some of the other dps that i have which is why i kind of stopped building him although i think that using him in sort of that um that specific place where it's like okay instead of artists i could use him maybe he's solid though a little bit of a you know aoe dps kind of going on as well as just some overall just solid dps but probably not going to be using him so 
on to our next one again we got the other purple one so i'm still waiting for it to show not purple because uh, i believe every 10 pull we don't necessarily get uh, a purple every single time on the basic summons there's the blue so yeah i was correct uh we're, looks like we're not gonna get elites so we can go to skip through this um on this one yep just a bunch of blues um and commons perfect on to our next 10 pull i don't know if this is the last run i wasn't paying attention actually can we see the purple on top of that capsule is that an easier way we could see it earlier on we did get a purple so maybe maybe that's true uh, maybe i could pay attention a little bit here and see hopefully we get a dupe of something that we already have uh, that's what i'm really looking for out of all the elites i just want dupes of the stuff that i already have i thought about buying the battle pass but i think i'm just gonna go full free to play this game is extremely pay to win um extremely in terms of like for mega krakens so if you're a, like a mega spender you do some really really crazy stuff with buying bailey copies which is insane but i don't think i want to spend it all i just think it'll be more fun looks like a purple to me i think that's a purple i think that we're going to end on a purple here which will be cool and i want to see how many far how many we're away from oh it was a blue we're going to see how many we are away from getting to pity because if we're close we may just go for that pity all right let's see so we are we got a lot of rewards didn't get anything crazy. We have a couple more um, rewards here. Uh, so definitely, I guess we guarantee a rare or elite hero every 10 times recruitment. So, okay, that's cool. Regardless, we have a, another 16 summons and we pulled, I believe, 27 last time. So we're going to get an elite here in this first 10 pull. Again, I'm hoping for that healer. That's probably what I'm hoping for the most. If I get a dupe of a character I already have, I'm completely okay with that. So pretty excited to see what we get here. Obviously, I think you can get triple S characters. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's only for limited banners, but let's see what we get. Come on. This guy has the most obnoxious long uh, entrance animation. Hercules. Ooh. Now that is someone I'm actually pretty excited about. Uh, I'll probably slot him in immediately, to be honest. I am pretty excited about him. I don't remember. I think he's a tank slash debuffer type character, right? Shield of Hercules, energy core barrier disappears, gains 20% more defense. Enemies in front of him. Uh, the user shall provide a shield to allies for 12 seconds prior to the island with the lowest HP. Every time he loses 20% of his HP, he'll sh he shall gain a shield for his own HP. Um, and then what does his ultimate do? User shall link to an ally, preventing them from any from receiving any damage debuffs when the link exists, and 70% of the damage they receive shall be transferred to Hercules over eight seconds. When there is no ally on the battlefield, Hercules shall receive a shield. So he seems like a pretty solid tank, um, decent AoE damage, and just overall shields and lots of defense. So not upset about that at all. We did get another 10 pull. Is that another 10 pull? Or that's 10 chips. So we got 10 chips here. Uh, so that's cool. I'm going to go ahead and cash in on the six extra ones that I have here for the advanced. Let's see if we get something cool. Go ahead and skip it. Skip through it. Uh, the game makes it super easy to do single summons here. So let's just do it real quick. Lots of Pelu. I'm not sure what to do with these rares, honestly. I'm not sure what to do with them. So if anyone in the comment section knows. And on the Haymon. So we actually got an elite here um, to follow it up. And we did get some more rewards. So that's pretty solid overall. I don't know. Overall, I, I, I'm decently happy with what we ended up getting, but I'm not sure what to do with all the characters that I have right now. Um, we'll have to decide if I want to go for Hercules. I think I will go for Hercules instead of Artis here. Um, I think he'll perform a little bit better than Artis. So I think I'll swap him in and we'll see where that takes us. That means I'll probably feed a couple of epics into uh, these guys. Like I'll probably feed something into Hercules probably keep artists i'm not sure what to do about Haymon here um this seems like uh some sort of character that's supposed to be a rare if i'm not mistaken is this normally a rare i'm not sure how all the ratings work in this game yeah so it's normally a rare but we got an elite copy um so probably just going to feed that one into my hercules so i can get some extra stats on that and then the only one that's missing out on stats is going to be Lyran. But she heals uh, based on max HP. So, you know, I can just stack a bunch of HP on her, hopefully, which I don't even have boots on her. So let's go equip some boots here and hopefully get some decent heals regardless. But overall, I'm pretty happy with that. Um, we didn't get anything crazy cool. Like we didn't get any of our, you know, triple S game changing characters, but we did get some solid characters, no doubt about it. Again, I'm not sure how the triple S system works. 
Um, I'm not sure if we're able to get that from here or if it's just the elite characters. Uh, it's possible that only the elites can be acquired from this. And the only way you can get triple S characters is through the limited banner. So I'm going to be holding on to my summons because I noticed that uh, this obviously will disappear after seven days or, you know, whatever it started at. I think these chips turn into uh, standard chips, I hope at least. Um, and then maybe next week or the following week, I will just dump everything to get my triple S character guaranteed because I do think it's probably important for me to get a triple S as a carry. And I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do it this week. So I'll probably jump the gun on summoning my seven summons, but I was excited. I want to play the game. No problem with that. But let me know how all your summons are going. I know we did uh, some couple summons video, but I got a couple of other tips here that I want to mention to all of you starting out the game. We have a couple more just real quick rare hero shards, which I'll just pop right here. Um, and we'll probably just get a bunch of rares, like I said. And then we have an elite hero shard. Maybe we'll get something cool here. We did get Randall, which is interesting. So maybe someone to consider looking at. <laughs> I did not expect to get something really cool, um, but we did end the video here with Randall. Hmm. I'm going to have to dig into this guy. I'm not sure on this guy. I just saw him that he was hot. So, you know, I ended up picking him up, but he does look cool. So something to, uh, I'll have to dig into and see what I want to form for my team comp. And I might have to come back to you all later on, but that's kind of where I'm at. I, I am progressing decently. Uh, you know, I, I'm through chapter 632. I'm just kind of grinding through. I haven't spent a lot of my resources so far, uh, and I'll explain why in the next couple of videos. If you want to check that out, be sure to sub to the channel, like this video. I'll see you then.